Hi there, this is Lynn Allen. Thank you so much for joining me for another AutoCAD tip courtesy of Catalyst Magazine. I'm enjoying a nice sunny day here in Northern California. I hope that wherever you are, the weather is good. It certainly is lovely today. So we're gonna be talking about setting your layer to be current. Okay, the layer command inside of AutoCAD is the third most frequently used command in AutoCAD, just in case you guys are on AutoCAD Jeopardy. And we set our layer current all the time, right? That's how we draw objects on a specific layer, by setting our layer to be current. And I'm sure you figured out how to do that by now. Otherwise, your time in AutoCAD has probably been a bad one if you haven't figured that out yet. I'm gonna show you three means of doing it, and hopefully one of them you don't know. All right, I think the last one is the most likely one that you may not know, but we want you to go as fast as possible in AutoCAD, right? All right, so the first means that I'm gonna show you to set your current layer is by using the ribbon. I certainly hope you're using the ribbon. I'm gonna come up to the drop down list for layers and it's easy, right? All you do is you select the layer that you want to be current. Can't, doesn't get much easier than that, am I right? Okay, so that's one means. You can also go to the layer dialog box, which I like to have docked on the left hand side of the screen. If you don't know how to do that, let me know. Maybe I'll do a tip on that. But I like easy access. So here, same, same deal. You just have to double click, right? Double click, it'll make it to the current layer. Easy enough. That requires a slight, slightly more steps, but it's another means of setting your current layer, right? All right, last but not least, this is the one I'm hoping maybe you don't know. I want to set my layer to be the same as this object right here. I don't really know what layer it is. I could do reconnaissance and find out, oh, it's on the elimination layer. But I wanna go as fast as possible, all right? So I'm gonna come up here to the ribbon and I'm gonna select the lay M Kerr command. I don't know how you say that, lame Kerr. I don't know, <laughs> it used to be an express tool. Grew up, became a real life AutoCAD command. So I'm gonna select that tool. I'm gonna to come down here and select this object. And just like that, it makes it the current layer. Super, super speedy, all right? So there were three different ways to set your current layer. I hope that at least you found one of them to be valuable to you. And I am gonna see you back here, hopefully, in two more weeks. Thank you for joining me.